Art style theft is a highly debated discussion in the art community revolving around the concept of being able to take someone else's style and steal it, making it your own, which is for some reason viewed as unlawful or disrespectful to the original artist or wrong or deserves any kind of backlash for it. Now, today I want to discuss my opinion on this concept and why I completely disagree with the mindset that you can steal an art style, let alone the concept that people deserve to be harassed over that or people deserve to be looked down upon for taking inspiration of another artist and making their own art in a similar style. But before I get into that, if you're new to the channel or haven't already, make sure to leave a like and subscribe as I make videos every single day on various different topics. As you can tell today, this is a bit of an oddball one, but it just seems like something I was interested in talking about. I also have many other social medias in the description, so if you want to go support me on any of those platforms, that would be appreciated a lot. In today's video, I'd like to shout out Teddy That Draws for their incredible art, some of their awesome animations and some of their content recently. Go support them as they genuinely do a lot of hard work to make good content. They stream basically every day and I really just want to send them some love. Can we get them to 1k subs? That would be really sick. I'm not sure if we can do it, but if you can, that would be absolutely insane. With that out of the way, let's get back onto the central focus of today's video. So firstly, I'd like to explain what people believe art style theft is. So the common consensus of art style theft is taking a style that someone else has drawn in and using it yourself to create your own art. Now, a lot of people would say that this is theft. And while I believe that art style theft does exist, I don't believe the term art style theft is the right term as in every piece of media, people take inspiration from each other or people do things in the same style, be that from YouTube videos that are done in the same style to basically every other form of media, from films that have same genres, same styles, same cinematography, to every other medium like music, for example, with a lot of grime, rap. Basically, every medium of content creation in the world has its own styles that people do in different ways. And copying that style or taking inspiration from that style, in my opinion, is not theft, as the act of theft is stealing something that someone else owned or made. However, in this situation, I don't believe you can make a style, as it you can't claim the way you draw something, it's just the way you draw something. So if someone is to draw in the same way as you, that doesn't necessarily mean that they're stealing from you. And seeing as it's their own work drawn by themselves, I don't believe that making your own piece of media that can look similar to something else or takes inspiration from something else can be considered theft or can be considered a wrong thing. Sadly though, a lot of people do get harassed over this. For example, I believe there was an artist who made art in a has-been hotel style and a lot of people started giving that artist backlash, claiming that they were stealing the style and it was a really dumb dispute where people were just attacking a poor innocent person because they drew something in a style they liked. As they say, imitation is the sincerest form of flattery and with creating your own piece of media that takes inspiration from another piece of media or is stylized like another piece of media, that's not theft as you're not profiting from someone else's work, you're profiting from your own work and it's not taken from someone else, it's made by you, the individual, with your own work, talent and time. It's not someone else's work to claim, own or pass off as theft of their own work. Like, there are shameless ways of stealing things. For example, there is the Russian Mr. Beast clone that for some reason steals every Mr. Beast thumbnail and idea. Now, although I may personally disagree with just copying someone else's thumbnail, putting it in Photoshop, slapping your face on top of theirs and then passing it off as your own video, in that situation, I do feel like there's a lot more validity to the term theft, as they're taking someone else's literal work that they've made, put their face on it, and then just pass it off as their own which I disagree with personally. However, in the situation of art style theft, if you're creating something yourself, you're not stealing it. It's ridiculous to say that that's theft. I do think it matters about the context or how that art is being used though, as if the art theft is used to mock or damage the reputation of the other artist, I can see validity to that claim. Also, if it's used on merchandise or 
in some sort of official medium that they're profiting from, I can understand a lot more if it's not clarified who the original artist is. I feel like there is a fair claim to be made that potentially they are to a degree stealing that style. However, I don't necessarily think that that is a bad thing. And I feel like a lot of artists should take that on the chin as if someone is to copy your style, it's more like them saying that they like your style so much that they wanted to do something in that style. It's like if someone was to take inspiration from one of my videos and make their own video like that, I think that's all perfectly fine as long as they're not using my own content for their content. So as long as they're making their own work, I feel like it's perfectly fine if they say and do the same things as me in their videos or present them in the same way as me, as long as they are turning their own original twist on it, like a lot of artists do when they steal art styles by drawing their own characters in their own ways with their own little details. As long as you're not actively tracing or copying or stealing art without crediting the original artist and passing it off as your own, I really don't see any issue with taking inspiration from another artist that you saw do a piece of art in a style that they like and just making their own art in that style. Also, I think I have no right to complain about people stealing art as I'm literally stealing the concept of a video from someone else for this one. So, I don't really feel like it's my place to say that someone's stealing anything. But genuinely, I feel like a lot of people would agree with me in the whole concept that stealing art really isn't a big thing. And it really isn't a big issue. It's like, if someone was to draw, for example, like in this thumbnail in a different artist's style, I don't have any issue with that. It's like, if it's your own work that you've put your own time into, go ahead. As long as you aren't actively trying to damage the performance of other people's art, or make profit off of their art, or genuinely copy-paste their artwork, I have no issue with it. Inspiration in any medium is fine, creativity in any medium is fine, and copying someone else's homework in any sort of medium is fine, as long as you're putting your own twist on it, and not just copying them one to one. But what do I know? I can't even draw. I mean, every piece of art on my channel is, 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 is art that I've ever commissioned or have been given. So. I guess I really have no place to speak on this drama, but if you agree with me, you agree with me. But anyway, let's start a discussion. So if you want to argue in the comments about your opinion, just don't harass anyone else. Let's have a fun little discussion on whether you think that art theft is a real thing. And if you think it isn't, then congratulations, you're based. <laughs> but with that out of the way, I hope you have enjoyed this video as these videos do take a lot of time to create from scripting them to finding the sources to contacting the people to get the thumbnail made to editing them. So if you want to support videos like this, just subscribe. That's all you need to do. Turn on notifications as well if you want so that you get notified every time I upload. Also, feel free to support the people that have helped make this video possible and feel free to support me by checking out my other social media platforms like my Twitter and my Discord and maybe if you want to just throw in a dollar, you can check out my Patreon or Ko-fi and fund me financially like the great Spy V, the great Spy62 and the great Ghost of Graver have all done to support me. Thank you to Cosmo for the art in the thumbnail. Go check them out. I really do appreciate them doing the art for me. It's really cool. And if you want to see more of my takes on stuff like anime, feel free to go watch my Wonder Egg Priority video. Feel free to go watch my Hell of a Boss video. And I really want to make a ReZero or Jujutsu Kaisen or a Silent Voice video soon. So if you want more anime reviews, they're coming, I promise. I just need to find a way to do them in a way that won't get me copyright claimed. I love copyright. Anyway, hope you have enjoyed this video. I'll see you next time. Peace. Says she wanna rock when it like me. I'm a stylish guy. Spend a little walk when it like me. We can catch a fly. Says she wanna rock when it like me.